Hello everyone, and uh, I just want to go ahead and make a video on this comment by Tetris Ash. It says, do you know anything about changing background music or custom title screen? Because uh, I've seen a lot of wads that don't have the Doom original Doom soundtrack. Um, and I figured I'd go ahead and take this time to make a tutorial on it, which is going to be pretty simple. Um, so in order to do this, we need a actual um, content editor for Doom, um, and what I use is uh, XWE. Now some people use um, Slumped um, and you know old school uh, WinTex, but um, we're going to use XWE for this um, tutorial. So we're going to go to DoomWorld.com/xwe. Okay come in here you can download it um, probably don't want to include the source let's see that's fine download it come down here hit the download XWE version 1.6 now I've already downloaded this so I'm going to show you the result after you have extracted it and uh, are ready to go so you'll eventually come up with something that kind of looks like this here because I put it in its own XWE folder. Um, and what we're going to do here is uh, you're going to double click XWE. Okay, you'll get a screen like this. Now it's going to pop up Doom because I've had this thing set. Um, the Doom mod since I've had this thing set for a while. It should pop up a window that uh, is going to ask you where your main WAD file is. And um, so you just have to point that out and you'll give a blank screen and you'll be ready. So what we're going to do is we're going to go File, Open, and we're going to find our Doom 2 WAD. So let me go into Doom, let me see, hang on, Doom WADs, okay, here we go. Doom 2, we're open Doom 2.WAD. And it's opening. It's got about 3,000 entries, so it's going to take a second. Okay. Right now, this is all the uh, items in Doom, including maps, monsters, everything. Okay. Down to the speaker sounds from your main computer um, that you're really old that you'll never see anymore. Uh, so, what we're looking for here is replacing the title screen. Okay. So, what we're going to do is we're going to go down to graphics down here, click it. Okay, we got this is all the graphics and stuff for Doom, including the numbers and, and the text and stuff like that. Um, even the status bar counts as a graphic. So what we're really looking for though is the title pick, which should be the second one down. And this is the main Doom 2 title pick. Um, so what we're gonna do is we're gonna copy this by going entry. I mean edit. Okay, we're going to edit, copy. Okay. Now what we're going to do is I'm going to start a new um, WAD file, which in this case you would just open your WAD file versus starting a new one. Um, so I'm going to start a new one. I'm going to call it, you know, blah, save. It doesn't really matter because I'm just using this as a test. And we're going to go paste. Boom. There's the title pick, right? So this is the title pick for the main um, Doom 2 sitting in our own little wad right here. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to replace this with a um, texture I've already, area graphic I've already made, which is just a regular Doom 2 graphic. It just, uh, you know, mine's better. So, uh, yeah, trust me. So I, uh, I'm going to go ahead and replace it with this. It's simple simple thing that I threw in paint. Um, so we'll go entry, replace. Now we're going to find and select that um, file. So my title was the name of it. Open. And my screen is better. Okay. So with that done, um, let me open the directory here that this WAD file is in. Get ready to run it. Okay. So here we are um let me put this <laughs> open it up and didn't put it in the right uh setting all right there we go all right so here we are here's the blah 
um, wad that we just inputted. So we're going to go ahead and drag that over to Z Doom. Um, and I'm going to jump it into Fraps so you can see what we've done so far. Okay, so here we are in the main, here's the main title screen, and you can see that my title screen is better. Um, it's going to flip in a second. But you can see that we have um, uploaded our, um, or set up our new title screen. So our title screen is completely set. Um, so we're going to go ahead and jump back out. Okay, so the next thing we're trying to tackle is actually putting uh, custom music in there as uh, that was the second part of the question um, changing the changing background music um, and basically the way we'll do this is we will uh, alright so we're going back to um, XWE into our blah wad and we're gonna go back and open doom 2 dot wad okay so we can grab some more entries out of there and the next entry we're going to grab is, uh, come down here on the bottom and we're going to go to music. And by clicking music you'll see these all these files pop up here and these files are actually the Doom music files. Um, and they're in order, you know, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, all the way through 32. And you have the readme, the title and the intermission um, and the opening now um, some of these are repeated throughout the levels you just have to um, figure out which ones have the same uh, music and uh, like I know 1 and 15 have the same music I'm not sure I'm pretty sure they're on the same music file too um, but anyway we're just gonna go um, map 01 for now which is D running okay so what we're gonna do is copy that come back to our blah wad and I opened the wrong one. Oh no I did open the right one see the thing is, is I'm set for music so I didn't see anything in here now if I go to all you'll see the graphics in there so if I click it back to music go to paste okay the running's in there alright that's the original music right so um, now what I'm going to do is I'm going to replace this music with some music I already have saved up over here. Um, you see right here, um, which is just the Bio Lizard theme from Sonic Adventure 2. If anybody all know that theme, it's pretty good. Check it out. Uh, so I'm going to replace the same way I did the title screen and select that okay so now we have a file in here notice all this went away but that's just because back in um, the original doom days they had to be actual mus mus file um, and that was basically converted from amenity file uh, or they had to convert it from amenity to do that but um, with later doom engines nowadays it doesn't even matter so um, I'm gonna go ahead and load this up um, and remember that this right here can be applied to any of those songs that you've seen in the previous list under the Doom 2 wad. If I wanted the title screen to be different, I'd do the title, you know, it's, it, it's in there. It you blah. So you should be able to um be able to come up with whatever song you want to replace. All right. So I'm going to go ahead and jump in the game and uh show you all this. All right. So here we are in game. Um of course, my title screen is still better. Check that out. Yeah, I know. It's pretty nice. Um, we're going to go ahead and start a new game. Uh, and if I turn up the music, you can hear the music is different in here. Hopefully, you can hear this good. Um, probably, I only hear a little bit of it. But the music is indeed different. So, um, and, and like I said, this will work for you know any of the levels that you want to replace the music for. So now that we see that it's working, we'll go ahead and exit out. All right, so uh, there we go. Um, I hope that pretty much answers your question there, Tetris Ash. Um, hopefully it's what you were looking for. 
And, uh, you know, anybody has any questions, feel free to drop a comment in this video. Uh, if you have questions about this, or maybe you'd like to see another tutorial up, um, don't be afraid to ask. Uh, and that's pretty much it. Um, thank you for watching.